Hello, welcome to another episode of This Week in Bikes. It's been quite a gap since the last video was recorded because I got knocked off my fucking bike and I've uh, got a nice little broken collarbone there. Take a look at that fucking thing. Oops. So I've been riding around a whole bunch on the indoor trainer. Obviously there wasn't much else I could do for the first little bit. And um, for the first kind of two weeks, I kept trying on and off to even sit on the thing and move my legs a bit and it was fucking agony. Um, but I think 19 days was when I got on there and, and things felt all right. And uh, I managed like 12 kilometers and then it still kind of hurt towards the end of that. I shouldn't have been trying to do an FTP test with one arm. But um, after, uh, I think the end of the third week, things felt fine. Um, I was I was riding about I did 32k and then, um, then that weekend I took the took the bike out upstate um, and tried doing a, another group ride with the lads which did not work out at all but um, it's good the the trainer definitely kind of helped keep me going through what was otherwise a pretty dark time. Anyway, while I was out of action, I took the time to work on work on fixing my bikes. Um, the the crash was the final blow for my Cannondale Synapse, which which now sounds a bit like a fucking maraca. So now that's wall art, and I have con transferred all my components onto a Super Six frame, and it's fucking dope. Um, it's really light and it's really fast. I've been riding it around a little bit the last couple of weeks, and um, I'll show that off a little bit at some point. But another thing I've been doing is uh, is having a bit of a mountain bike. Um, the doctor said that I shouldn't be doing any road races till June, which is a couple of weeks away. Um, so I decided that uh, going mountain biking was was a cracking idea, um, and that worked out really well. Oh, good thing I'm wearing a helmet. <laughs> oh, my ass. <laughs> what a fucking moron. Uh, I know a fair few people they will be pretty excited to see me land on my face, but I feel like that video doesn't quite do it justice. So uh, let's have a look from another angle in slow motion, shall we? <laughs> What a tit. So uh, what with all the crashing and the, the broken bones and the, and the, the videos in slow motion and everything, uh, my friends and family are starting to get a little bit worried about me riding about. And, uh, and I figured the best thing to do would be to uh, get the most dangerous bike possible so I can just hurry up and get it all over and done with. Um, so to do that, I've built myself a fixie. It's pretty cool. Uh, it's it's the most Brooklyn thing ever, thanks to the color scheme. But the um, the none of this none of this was really chosen. Most of this is just random random parts that I could find lying about. Uh, the frame is a surly cross check, and it's got loads of different mounting options. So eventually, it will it will grow and evolve over time from uh, from a no brake fixie to um, to a kind of winter trainer slash commuter um, slash touring bike I'm going to take this take this thing you know to different countries and go all over the place and it's a little bit heavier 
This has been put together really, really cheaply. Um, massively thanks to my, my roommate, Elvis, who is an ex-bike mechanic. Um, he has been fucking fundamental to this project. And while I've dicked around with bikes a fair bit, there's, there's a lot of stuff I have no idea. Thanks to him and a few long nights of pressing our headsets and fucking driving our star-fangled nuts, um, we've got we've got a really cool bike. Um, the whole thing was less than less than eight hundred bucks. Uh, obviously, thanks to thanks to a lot of the free bits, and um, I'm gonna I'm gonna work on it and make it better over time. So you'll you'll see it pop up a little bit. Um, but I took it out for its maiden voyage on Friday, which was a little bit terrifying because the uh, the handlebars started to come off while I was riding, and I didn't know how to stop, so I just fixed it while I was riding. subscribing get a little notification when stuff comes out uh gonna be racing two big events this weekend it's gonna be a fucking crazy weekend uh there is the uh ride to montauk happening on saturday 150 mile kind of casual ride with a whole bunch of uh stops for beer along the way so that's just my kind of ride um and then sunday is the grand fondo which will be interesting riding up bear mountain and back so I'm going to be shattered, but hopefully I'll get some decent footage from one of those two events. Um, yeah, see you around.